So we are at Hazrat train station today. We're getting a two hour train journey to Agra. We got our tickets on 12 Go Asia. So we literally just arrived here by a rickshaw. We're figuring out how to even get into the train station because he didn't drop us at the entrance. But we were walking the wrong direction for ages. Yeah. There was a sign over here saying reservations this way, but it was an exit. So I'm just going to go back this way now. And Everyone's walking a different direction, but we'll see. <laughs> I would strongly advise coming here minimum an hour before your train because it's extremely crowded and we haven't even found where we can get the tickets yet or yeah I, I don't know it's a bit <laughs> messy this place. Uh, booked our tickets for the 12 Go Asia. We have tickets already yeah show me. Can I get it for you? But that was actually so simple all we did is been up to the information desk and showed our tickets and just said just go platform three. I don't even think you need to go to the information desk or the ticket desk if you booked it online because yeah. they said the one on our phones is okay. So you Hopefully, just look yeah. at the yeah look at you just look at the screen and for platform number three that's all. Yeah, because usually when we get trains, they always ask for a printout, but they said the phone's okay for us. So uh -huh. hopefully we'll see. This is disgusting, but I'm literally sweating through my top. I cannot describe how hot this place is. It's just dry, heavy humidity. We're, I thought we'd get used to it now, but I'm actually not. <sighs> I think if we were coming straight from Ireland to here, unprepared, I'd be dying. But we are, we are a few months traveling in Sri Lanka and Indonesia and hotter countries, so we're a little bit prepared. But um, yeah, can't wait to get on an AC train. I want nothing more right now. I've never seen a train that big before. That kept going. <laughs> going and going. For like two minutes straight. I wonder is our train that big? I think so. I think it's the same. Yeah. That was so loud as well. All right, so our train has arrived. It was an hour late, and now we have to find the AC place. So I think it's at the end yeah. of the train. We got, we got first class tickets, so it's our own cabin. This is the AC economy. Okay. We keep going down here. Oh, okay, it's absolutely roasting today. We're sweating. Try and find it now. That's still AC economy. We don't know how to get into the train. All the doors are locked. So we're gonna have to go down to the end and possibly go up through the carriages, but trying to figure it out. So everybody's running down this way now. Come on, Julie. <laughs> oh, imagine it just took off and after being late for an hour. I don't think it'll do that. So. so it turns out that's not our train. It was one that was actually on time for this platform. Our train is on the other side because it got changed. Thankfully, we had some locals to help us. Julie was Here. banging on doors. Finally. Oh, this, coming? this heat isn't good for sitting an hour, hour for an hour. Sitting around, around, sitting around. Oh my God, I'm exhausted. I was only standing. So hot. I'm just gonna get the door open. What we do earlier, just putting on the doors. Hey, we're in. Finally. Right. Very narrow. And there's the AC, thank God. Oh my God, that AC feels so good. Alright, so I don't know what we're in here now to figure it out. So Daniel made a mistake while he was booking a train. He's went to book first class, but we got third class. It's not third class. It's huh? a different third type AC. of train. Third, third AC. AC. Yeah. Uh, third AC. Different train. Yeah. <laughs> it's all good. These are the sweets I bought yesterday. I don't know what they are, but they're really good. They're coming in handy now because I'm so hungry. There we go. Take one. I really like these. I don't know what they are. They remind me of something. It's 
So I just came up to test up the tap bunk and it's actually really nice. It's not as cold as the bottom ones, the other ones are quite cold because the SE is really blasting out. I think we're over halfway now, so another probably an hour to go and we'll be in Agra. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. 20 yeah. rupees. Let's go. 10 rupees. 20, there we go. Thank you. He's a grafted. Train. Huh? He needs to get off the train, does he? He needs to jump out. house. So. <laughs> That's why I needed the money. So I had a little snooze and woke up to some joy. Our favourite. You see this in every India vlog that we do. Eating um, and really drinking chai. Mm. This kind of man offered me some <laughs> Indian Domino's. It's meant to be really spicy. <laughs> this is my first time yeah, trying it. Yeah, you used to eat a spicy food, so yeah. Okay. So it's a bit style pizza. Yeah, so you can you can't get this anywhere else, bar India. So that's why I'm trying it. It looks really spicy. Look at it. Get a close up. So chilies, peppers. What's this? Chicken? Uh, paneer. 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 Cheese. Oh, okay. Yeah. Did you order this? And then it was here when you arrived. Yes. Oh, that's such a good idea. Oh, that's good. Can I also have it? No, no, I'll, it's okay. I'll have a bite of this. Thank you. <laughs> Not too spicy. It's nice. It's very nice. It's good. This is our stop. This is our stop? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, we get off now. There you go. Exit. Hello. Alright, so we've arrived in Agra. Oh. That's oh, it's hot again. <laughs> that train ride was okay. It was about three hours long. And I had AC, so we're fine. Now we need to, I don't know if they've Uber here or not, but I booked a hotel at the Taj Mahal, literally outside the Taj Mahal. So we need to get an Uber straight there, I think. So I don't think Julie will be letting me book any trains from now on. Well, to be honest, that was okay. I did. That was absolutely fine. I didn't mind that. Um, we were just hoping to get the first class cabin to ourselves that we've seen, but we can do that on the way back or something. It's okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's just really nice. It was comfortable. Yeah, very comfortable. Yeah, and the people beside us were really nice. They shared food with us, and yeah, yeah. it was a nice experience. Yeah, it was great. But now so. we're gonna go find a taxi to our place, and then we're gonna go out and explore Agra a bit before tomorrow. This place is way busier than the train station in Delhi. I don't know if it's because of the time people are done work or what. We're gonna get bombarded with taxi drivers now. Yeah. I don't thank you. It's okay. Taxi, please. It's okay. Thanks. You don't need one. No, no, thank you. No, thank you. No, no, it's all good. YouTuber, Zoe. Yeah. Zoe. Hello. 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 <laughs> so we got rid of one rickshaw driver and then another one comes trying to get us into his rickshaw but we're gonna get uber just because it's safer and it brings you to our location straight away just keep walking julie he said that we can't get collected here which you can uber works here by the way you definitely get uber yeah they were charging a lot more in uber's 80 so yeah uber's 80 rupee and uh rickshaw they were the same was 250. Okay. so yeah so we have more coming here hello we have a taxi coming here yeah no we have one coming hello hi We've arrived. Yeah. This is crazy. Yeah. <laughs> Julie? Yeah. 1711. This is absolutely nuts. <laughs> this roundabout is crazy. Alright, we found our tuk tuk anyways, and now we're going to head to our hotel. I we do. Know, I don't know how he found us. Yeah, because the maps were showing he was the first at his roundabout. So he just must have seen Julie's profile picture and spotted us. But yeah, we're on our way now.
we made it to our hotel room. We've actually been in here for the last couple of hours. I fell asleep on the couch. Yeah. <laughs> I think I've no food. I need to get food. All I had today was jam and toast and it's six o'clock now and I've no food. Well, I got this place for 10 euro a night and then I paid an extra five for breakfast and it has AC and it's 300 meters away from the Taj Mahal house so we can just walk to it tomorrow morning. Yeah, it's very convenient for us, but the room's actually very nice so I'll give you a little tour now as we walk in. Come on, Julie. Show the people oh. the room. Okay, here we go. Very spacious. Tiles. Got AC here. Got a fan. Big, bigger than a double bed. A nice TV that we won't be using because we have to be up at 4 a.m. tomorrow morning to go to the Taj Mahal. Mirror for my makeups. Wardrobe. Actually, this is a nice bathroom. Toilet. Toilet. Hot shower. Hot and cold, but we like to have cold showers. And that's it. Bob's your uncle Mary's your aunt. Yeah. <laughs> And yeah, so we're, we googled up a we Dolly said we googled up a restaurant. I don't know what I'm saying. But we, we looked up the best restaurant in Agra, and we found this place called Nuwabi. Nuwaba. Nuwaba. But we're it's a Mumbai go. branch. Yeah, we're gonna go there and eat. We're absolutely starving. I didn't eat since that Domino slice that that man gave me earlier.